I'm so excited to eat all of my cookies and watch the next episode of The Great Cookie Bake Off. <laughs> Milo, what is it? Nico's in trouble. Oh no. What happened, Milo? He fell off the ladder. How is that even possible? <laughs> we were playing hide and seek together. Teddy jumped up. Oh no, Milo, we need to get Nico to the hospital. Nico needs surgery. <laughs> Milo, be kind. We're here to help our friend Nico. I guess so. Oh, we just have to wait for the doctor to come out and get us. I hope everything's okay. Me too. You must be Milo and Chip. I have some bad news. Oh no! We killed Nico! You're right, Milo. Everyone's gonna hate us. This is so sad. There is a way you can both save him, but it is very dangerous. Please yeah, Doctor, we'll do anything we can. Well, if you want to help Nico, you need to shrink down in size and enter his body through his ear. Make your way around his insides and fix anything that's broken. Okay, we'll definitely do that. Yeah, we totally will. I know we can. We can do anything. He's right through that door. Whoa, Milo, look, there's Nico on the table. He looks so you're right, he definitely needs some surgery. And luckily, we're so good at that, so we'll be able to help him. Yeah, I'm a professional doctor! Yeah, totally, but wait, the doctor said something about a shrinking machine somewhere. All I see is a surgery table and Nico. Maybe this bathtub is a shrinking machine! I don't know, that looks like a sinking machine. Get it? Because it's a sink? Ah, you're so funny! Wait, Milo, this machine looks really complicated. This must Machine. You're right. Uh, you should go inside first. Uh, okay. Whoa, I can't believe that worked. Okay, Milo, I'm gonna press the button in three, two, one. Something weird is happening. Whoa, Milo, I don't see you. Where did you go? I'm tiny like a molecule. Whoa, Milo, you're so small. Chip, you look like a giant. Don't stump on me. Wow, this is amazing. The shrinking machine really works. Okay, it's your turn now. Okay, fine. Are you tall enough to press the button? No. Okay, I guess I'll have to press it for myself. All right, Chip, hurry up then. All right, Milo, I'm going to press the button in three, two, one. Press! Whoa, it shrunk me down. <coughs> There's smoke everywhere. And wait a minute, Milo, is that you? It's me. You're tiny as well. Whoa. You're right, it worked. This is awesome. We can totally get inside his head now, but wait a minute, Milo. That table is really tall. We need to find a way to get over there. We're gonna have to do some crazy parkour. You're right. Luckily, the doctor has a table that we can use to get across. Whoa, that is a long gap. Chip, this is a really big gap too. I think you can make it. Oh no, Milo, you fell in the snow. Because we're tiny, we can go inside it like that. That is crazy. We need to get to the end. <gasps> Whoa, Milo, there's a lake. Don't fall in, Chip. Oh, wait, this is the sink from earlier. We really are tiny. I can't believe it's right here. And look, there's more snow. Uh-oh. We made it, Milo. We're on the surgery table. Okay. Now we just have to find a way to get inside his body. But wait a minute, Milo, the answer is right here. It's his ears. Oh, we can jump right in. You're right, Milo. All right, I think we should do it together. In three, two, one. Whoa, we made it. We're inside Nico's ear. It's so yummy in here. This is disgusting. I don't think Nico has ever cleaned his ear in his life. Look at all these hairs everywhere. Ew, and the earwax. Too. That's so yucky. Yuck, it's so gross. I don't want to touch it. Milo, I think we might have to. If we don't break all of this stuff and clean his ear, we won't be able to get inside his brain. That's so true. Okay, let's clean his ear then. Yeah, oh God, ew, this is so yucky. How did he let it get this dirty? He needs to clean his ears and go to the doctor. Okay, and we're almost done. Wow. You're right. There's a bit of dirt, but I don't know. We're doctors, not cleaners. That's so true. <laughs> Whoa, Milo, is this his brain? What? He has such a big brain. Wow, actually, I don't think it's big. I think we're just really tiny. Oh, yeah, I forgot. 
dark! Whoa, there are levers on the side of it. And wait, why is there a light that's not on? Oh no, his brain must not be switched on! Oh wow, that's so bad! We should probably try to turn it on again, otherwise he might never wake up! Which lever is gonna turn the brain on? I have no idea. We just have to try them all and see. I'm gonna get it first! No way! I'm gonna get it first. Oh, not fair! Wait, Milo, I did it! I turned the light on! Wow, good job, Chip! Thanks, Milo. I guess we are both great doctors. Yeah, we do surgery every day! Wait, there's a door behind here. Why would Nico have a door inside his brain? I wonder where it leads to! Maybe it's a secret compartment! Whoa. That could be where he stores all his secret crosses or something, but I don't know. We should probably see what's behind it. And whoa! It's his teeth! Wait a second! Does he have spinach stuck in his teeth? Ew, yeah, that's disgusting. When was the last time he ever brushed his teeth? That's so yucky! Oh gosh, I hope I don't have any spinach in my teeth! Wait, wait, let me see, Milo. Open <laughs> wide. Um, Milo, you don't have any teeth. You just have a bird beak. Yeah, but Nico definitely does. We should probably remove as much of this spinach as we can before we go inside his throat. Yeah, otherwise he might get really, really extra sick. Yeah, and I think he needs the extra vegetables. Yeah, me too. Ah! Okay, I think we've done all the spinach on the bottom teeth, but there's still some on the top to go. How do we get up there? That's a really good question, Milo. Wait, I know exactly what to do. If I put you on my shoulders, maybe now you can reach. Yeah! Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Whoa, it's working. We have really good teamwork. Wait, there's two stuck right at the top. How are we going to get those ones? Try jumping. Hmm, I don't know if that's going to work. I think we need something else to get us up there. Oh, no, now we're stuck on this level. Uh-oh, wait a minute. Milo, I know what we can do. What? We can take some of his brain to use as a ladder. But what if this part of his brain tells him to talk? Uh, maybe that'll be a good thing. Okay, I really hope this part of his brain wasn't important. Yeah, me too. All right, let's go now, clean his teeth. Okay, sorry, Nico. We'll give your brain back in a second. He might not even need it unless we save him. Good point, Milo. Okay, I'm going to tower up here. We need to be really careful. If we fall onto the teeth, we could break our bones and need surgery. Imagine having to do surgery inside a surgery. Uh-oh, uh that would be so bad. All right, I think I've got it. Okay, we did it, Milo. We got the spinach. Now we just have to put his brain back. Sounds good to me. And then where do we go next? All right, here we go. I hope he didn't notice. Me either. All right, but wait a minute. Now we have to get up on his teeth again. Dang it, Chip. Why can't you think properly? I can pick you up on my shoulders. What? Oh, this isn't going to work, Chip. Yes, it will, Milo. We just have to time our jump correctly. All right, are you ready? Yes. Jump off in three, two, one. What? Okay, now just pick me up. Okay, stay still. Oh, yes, it worked. Hooray. You're so smart. Now let's see what's down his throat. Uh-oh, I'm really scared. That's a big drop and some yucky water. Ew, that's disgusting. Uh-oh, Milo, I think I know what's down there. What is it? His stomach. <laughs> Whoa, this is disgusting. Yeah. Whoa, Milo, look! There is food all over Nico's tummy. He must eat so much. I wonder where he got all this food from. Yeah, he probably stole it because I know for a fact he cannot cook. And look, this burger looks like something I made in my kitchen the other day. I thought it went missing. Wait a minute, and hey, look! That pepperoni pizza on the wall is exactly the same one that went missing from my kitchen last week. <laughs> This is disgusting. I think we need to get all the food out of here. I'm gonna start cleaning up the thing. Me too. I'll also help. This is so disgusting. There's so many gross things on the walls. You're right. Why is he eating so much pizza? Maybe he's got worms in his tummy. Ew, that's disgusting. He also has a bird and a human in his tummy, so I don't think he needs anything else. Wait, do I have a bird and a human in my tummy? 
Uh, I don't think so, Milo, unless you're also in surgery. No, I'm not in surgery. Yeah, that's good. I don't think I am either, but uh, we need to get rid of this giant pizza. It's gonna take us forever. Oh, you're so right. Okay, maybe we can leave the pizza for now. Yeah, he can have it. Otherwise, he would totally starve, and I guess we don't want to hurt him that bad. That's true. We want to make him feel better. Yeah. Wait, now that we've destroyed all the food, the tummy feels weirdly empty. Yeah, something weird's going on here. Hang on, Milo. Do you hear that rumbling? Ah! Whoa! There are monsters inside his tummy. Oh, no, this is not good. Nico must be really sick if there's this many monsters. You're right. It's a sick bug. Oh, gosh. How are we going to help him? I don't know, Chip, but I'm really scared right now. We've got to fight off every single one of these monsters. Otherwise, Nico could get even more sick and need surgery again. Chip, they've got me cornered! Milo, I'm coming to save you. Help me! Oh no, they're getting me too. Milo, what have you done? Come here. Why? I can't get them. Okay, I've got you, Milo. Don't worry. Thanks for picking me up, Chip. But where can we go? I'm not sure. These monsters are really annoying. They're so powerful. We need to find a way out of here. Wait a minute, Milo. There are two doors over there. We just need to find the one that gets us out. Oh. That's a really good point. But look, Milo, the slimes are really big. There's no way the other monsters could even fit around them. That's really true. So we have to lead a slime over to the right door. Yeah, good idea. But first, we should get all the other monsters away so that we have a clear line of sight. Okay, I'll distract them by doing a crazy dance. Wee, wee, wee. Wee, wee, wee. I am Milo. Thanks, Milo. All right, what's through here? All right, Milo, it's safe. Come on. Okay. Come on, Milo! I'm here! Whoa, that was so close. Hopefully none of the mobs follow us. Yeah, you better stay away! Oh, don't get too close to the door, Milo. We don't want you getting sick as well. Look, Milo, there's another door at the end of this passage. I wonder where this one leads to. Me too. All right, hopefully there are no monsters on the other side of this one. Fingers crossed! Oh. Milo, you don't even have fingers. Oh, uh, yeah! Fingers crossed! Good idea. All right, I can't wait to see what's on the other side. And whoa, is this his ribs? This must be his spine. Whoa, you're totally right, Milo. And look, oh, poor Nico. His spine is broken. Oh my gosh, he must have broken his back when he fell off the ladder. You're totally right. We need to find some sort of way to fix this. Oh, well, I don't know how to fix. You said you were a professional doctor, Milo. Yeah, well, I lied. What? Milo, you can't lie about that. Hmm, I'll just have to think of a solution. All right, so if the bones are missing from the spine, we just need to find new bones and put them in their place. Okay, but you can't take mine. What? Okay, Milo, I'm obviously not going to take your bones. Your bones are too tiny. Well, you're always trying to steal things from me, so I don't trust you. Okay, okay, fine. Hmm, we just need to find some big size bones to put inside Nico's ribs. Yeah, where could they be? That's a really good question, Milo. And look, they're over here. I've got them. Wow, can I have some so I can repair the bones? Okay, but be really careful. These bones are so fragile. Okay, I'll be super, super careful. All right, we just need to put them back in the exact same spot. Otherwise, we might give him some extra bones, and we do not want that. That would be really crazy. I wouldn't want any extra bones. Yeah, me neither. Hey, Chip, look over here. What is it, Milo? Oh, my gosh. What have you done? It's a chip statue. What? No, Milo. You can't do that. This is really serious. Oh, sorry. I didn't know I could build more bones. Milo, I told you not to build any more bones than the ones he needs. Well, Milo, we're getting rid of this statue now. Fine. That was really close. And hey, you've placed these ones wrong as well. You need to be so careful. It doesn't matter. As long as his ribs are fixed, it's fine. Milo. And fixed. Milo, don't do anything like that again, please. Okay, I'll be really careful this time. I'm watching you to make sure you're not lying. Okay, look. Oh, wow. Okay, you actually did it. Now, I'll do this one over here. 
And done. Okay, we've done these bones. Do you see any more broken ones? And hey, wait a minute. Wasn't this fixed before? No. Milo, did you break more of his bones? No. Uh, I do not believe you. I'm going to put these ones back safely. And if I turn around and see any more broken bones, I'm going to be so angry. Okay. I don't think any more of them are broken. Good job, Milo. Thanks, Chip. I'm really responsible. Uh, yeah, totally. But wait a minute, Milo. Now that we've fixed his broken bones, we need to get back to the surgery room and become normal sized again. That's so true. If he wakes up too early, we might be stuck inside here forever. Oh, I don't want to be stuck inside his ribcage. Neither do I, Milo. Let's quickly run back into the stomach to make sure we don't get stuck. Okay, but what if the that's a really good point. All right, we just have to be so careful to make sure the monsters aren't here. And okay, I think the coast is clear. Wow, the stomach acid must have eaten them all up. That's right, Milo. We can't go back in there. It must be too powerful. But hang on a minute. How are we going to get back up to the throat? Oh, no, that's too far of a climb. We'll never make it. You're right. We need to get into that door over there. Okay, Chip, you leave the way. <laughs> Whoa! It's his heart! Oh my gosh, look at all the veins everywhere! That's gross! They're probably pumping all the blood all around him! Ew! He's got a really big heart! Wait a minute. And he's also got a really, really big picture of Zoe on it! Oh my gosh, that means he loves Zoe! Wait a minute. Does he have a crush on her? Oh, that's so funny! He has a crush on Nico has a crush on Zoe. You're right, Milo. Wow. I wish he could be here with us and see this. That's so embarrassing. I can't believe we found out his secret. Whoa. We need to tell everybody. I'm gonna make a tweet. Yeah. Oh, I get it. Because you're a fatty. But wait, Milo, we can only do that when we get out of here. Oh, my God. Whoa, the room is shaking. That is not good. Does that mean he's waking up? You're right, Milo. If he's waking up, we don't have much time left. Hmm, how are we going to get out of here? I don't know. Is there another door? Wait, Milo, you're right. There is another door. Milo, are you ready to go through this door? Yes. All right, me too. I can't wait to see what's on the other side. And whoa, what is this place? Uh, this is yours. Milo, if these are stones, then this must be his kidneys. He has kidney stones. Oh, poor Nico. I bet they hurt so much. Yeah, probably. We better get mining, Milo. Okay, let's mine away all of these kidney stones. Totally. Whoa, what's happening? Wait a minute. There's bugs inside his kidney stones. Yeah! It's a great thing that we're professional doctors and we can cure him of everything. We're giving Nico surgery! Uh-oh, I hope there's none left. Oh no, look, there's one! Ah, get away from me! All right, Milo, we did it. We broke all of the stones. His kidneys are looking really healthy. Yeah, they are. The only thing that's in there that shouldn't be is, you know, us. Oh no, we need to get out before he fully wakes up. Whoa, it's shaking again. It's happening sooner and sooner. He's going to wake up so quick. And if we don't get out in time, we'll be stuck here. Okay, let's run. Wait, what's through this door, Milo? If we're in his kidneys and this is the door, um, I think I know where this is heading. Where? Ew, we're in his butt. That's so gross. Yeah. Milo, we have to, to get out, but ugh, this is so gross. Fine, I'll go in, but it's so gross. All right, Milo, you have to go first. Uh, does this mean he's going to poop us out? Ugh, that's so gross, but yeah, I guess you're right. Uh, okay, I'm going to go. Count down, Milo. I'll be watching you. All right, three, three, four. What? not how you count. Milo is really bad at counting, but all right, I guess it's our turn to jump down now. Bye, Nico! Milo, we did it! We're outside! Hooray! And look, Nico is sitting up again! Nico, Nico, can you hear us? I think we're too small for him to hear. You're right, we're tiny. Hmm, wait, we need to get big again by using the shrinking machine in reverse. Okay! Whoa, this is a big drop. All right, Milo, I've calibrated the machine. We're going to get big in three, 
two, one. Wow! It worked. We're normal size again. Thank goodness. Being tiny was really scary. Nico, Nico, did it work? Are you safe? Is our friend back? Thank you, guys. You saved my life. But uh, you guys smell so bad. Hey, that's offensive. Come here. 